What is going on, guys? Paul here. Let's get back to it. So far, we don't know what happened to Ash. I think it was, no, Sam or, no, not Sam. Let me actually look this up quick. One of the girls fell off a cliff or something. And uh, we don't know what happened to her. She could be in trouble. So, it was, it was you know, the chick with the fucking pigtails. Anyways, the story's going to be pretty good, so let's continue it. You gonna come with me to get my bag? Yeah. Yeah, I'm coming. I'm sorry to grab that. Madam? Why, thank you, sir. Come on, baby. I think we should start the weekend over. Right now. Clean slate. Oh? No arguing. No Mike. No Jess. Just you and me enjoying ourselves and all this nature. Oh, you mean oh natural? Damn straight. I can get with that. Power's on. Alright. Hey, Doofus, come this way. Trying to get me somewhere private? 
Why don't you uh, come find out? Ooh, I can't stand her. Wait a second. Let's just see real quick, because I know this game likes to do this, but I want to see if there's anything over here. Because this game likes to fuck with you and act like there's like not something that there's not there. All right. Yeah, there's something there. Thanks for helping me find my bag. I know I can be a little high maintenance. It's no problem, babe. But you gotta remember, there's more to this guy than just being a lean, mean, luggage-lifting machine. Oh you gonna back God. that up? All day. <laughs> what? All day. <laughs> wow. Wait, what is that? Loser. Mean? Like, all day long. I was being like... Sexy. <laughs> oh. Dude, what the fuck? Nice to be here with you, muscle man. Ah, uh, I'm not all muscle. <laughs> there are some brains in here, too. Well, you got enough brains to like me, so let's see that brawn. You ever done it outside before? Outside of what? My car. I like your car. Roomy. This ain't roomy enough for you? You know what? Maybe there's a better spot. Does this spot start with a G? There are lots of places out here. I already started clearing this all for us. Like a gentleman. Oh, come on. Let's look around. Oh. Well, look at that. Hey. Hell, Em. Don't be jealous. Why would you take me here? You made me feel like a chump. Don't be so sensitive. I'm here with you right now. Mike's the chump. Okay, maybe chump isn't the right word. What is? Lucky. Hmm. You got in there. What's so important in the bag, anyways? It's just my undies. The lacy ones. Well, hell, we don't need those. You don't want me to model them for you? I'm just gonna rip them off, anyways. Maybe I want to show them off. It puts me in a generous mood. Let's go get them. Kisser on this thing, dare to put your hand in it. Oh, look, it's a totem. Day, I wouldn't. Just slide it up in there. 
Madam. Thank you. Oh my, very impressive. Welcome back. Whoa. Uh... Huh. It's creepy. Wow, that's weird. It's gotta be Chris. Or Josh. They're just trying to mess with us. Kind of uncool, guys. I don't like this. Me neither. Oh! Matt! What the hell's going on? What the hell did this? You know, I'm kind of not giving a shit about my panties anymore. I kind of just want to split. Agreed. Here we go again. Back to the therapist. What the? Why? Uh -huh. What's going on here? I would like to understand your feelings toward people of fear, isolation, loneliness. Do you share this fear? Hmm. Make him a psychopath. And how do you feel about people who are afraid? I see well Mike has a fear of isolation. Do you feel pity for him? Indeed. That is apparent from the choices you made. And now, let us investigate your feelings toward other people in greater depth. What you value, what you respect in yourself and others. Which would you say was most important in a person? Loyalty or honesty? So, you would tell the truth, even if it resulted in an unpleasant outcome for a friend. And what about honesty then? And charity? <laughs> charity is overrated, I suppose. Better to be true to yourself than to help others in need, eh? Oh, well, once again, I'm afraid we're out of time. We'll talk again soon. It was 
just a prank, Han. Today is the one-year anniversary of the dreadful tragedy of Hannah and Beth Washington, the twins who are still missing. I know it would mean so much to Hannah and Beth that we're, we're all still here together, and I'm thinking of them. Whoa, hello. Somebody's getting a little friendly. Boom. Butterfly effect. Excuse me? Did you say something? Oh, did you not hear me with your sluttiness? Stop it! Mike, why don't you check out the guest cabin, the one I told you about? Yeah. Yeah, all right. Did you hear that? What in God's name are you wearing? Here's our one-way ticket to the spirit realm. Oh, watch out for that, Josh. He's a schemer. Well, if that's how it's gonna be. Yes? <coughs> yes! So, it says here, to communicate with the spirit world, you must free your mind of all preconceptions, drop all inhibitions, and generally give yourself over entirely to the will of others, sublimating your every desire to the whims of the spirit master, which is me. It doesn't say that. And all present will remove their garments at my sole discretion. Chris, come on, this is serious. <laughs> oh, I'm deadly serious. <laughs> oh, shush it. Let's try this. Yes, please. Okay, then. And let's see what happens. Ashley, since... You're a recent convert. Why don't you be Armenian for today? Okay. Um, is anyone there? Will you reveal yourself to us if you're there? Wait a minute. Did you do that? I didn't do anything. It's moving again. <laughs> H? What's it spelling? Hold on. How's this happening? Are you moving it? I swear, it's just moving. Holy shit. Help? How are we supposed to help? I don't know. What does it mean? We need to know who it is if we're supposed to help them. How can we help you? <laughs> it's moving again. Whoa. What's it spelling? <laughs> War. It's moving fast. Warning. Shit. Oh my god. Warning? I think we uh, really need to find out who's trying to communicate with us. We can't help you if we don't know who you are. Can you tell us who you are? Oh, here it goes. Okay, S. I. S. T. E. R. Sister. Sister? Who's sister? Oh, come on, is this for real? Shut up. Ask it who's sister. Josh, it's, it's gotta be. Yeah, okay, well, which sister is it then? Ashley, ask who it is. are we speaking to? Hannah? Is that you? Oh, God. <laughs> this is messed up. Josh, are you? I'm fine. Are you sure? Because we can stop. No. Dude, it, it's cool. I want to hear what it says. This fucking guy, I can't stand that dude. Start? Think about it. If this is actually Hannah, I mean, we can find out what happened that night. Josh? I can handle it. Okay. Um, let me think. Hannah, if you can hear this, like, really hear this, we all want to apologize for what happened. It, it was stupid and, and mean and we're sorry. We're so sorry, Hannah. B? E? T? R? Uh-oh. I don't like this. Betrayed. What does she mean? Oh, it, it's still going. Oh, God. K-I-L-L-E. 
D? D? No. Don't kill. We didn't kill them. It was just a prank. A Ash, calm, calm down, okay? Just, we, we, we need to find out more. I'm sorry. I am guys, so guys, sorry. What, what, what do they mean? Ask them what, what happened. It's, it's, the, it's the only way to know. Ask them, Ash. Okay. Who killed you? Hannah, who was it? L? I? B? The library. Maybe there's something in the library here? E? R? O? O? Proof. There, there's, there's proof. In the library? Oh, my God. Oh. <laughs> Holy shit. Chris? You know what? No, this is bullshit. This isn't real. Josh, I don't know what's going on. Listen, look, I don't know. I don't know if you think messing with me is somehow going to help me deal with my grief or whatever, but this is not cool. Josh, no. You wanted to use the spirit board. Hey, hey calm down. It's, it's not actually. I don't need this right now, OK? You guys are full of it. Sh should we go after him? Ah, man, I, I mean, he'll be OK. Let's, let's just give him some time. I don't blame him. That was crazy. The pointer flew right off the table. I mean, if, if you were faking it, if you were doing one hell of a job. I wasn't faking anything. I think we should do what it says. We should look in the library. Wow. Are you dead? <laughs> Jess! Oh. What's your name, Jess? Jess, where did you go? This is not funny. Jessica, oh, come on. Jess, buddy, you in there? Oh my god. Oh! Ah! Whoa! Christ! <sighs> Holy shit. Just got blue out of my jeans. <laughs> the hell is that doing in there anyway? Jess? Hun? Light of my life? Seriously? This is not funny. Wait, is there like something on this mask? Hold on. Wow. That scared the shit out of me. I totally promise I won't murder you. Oh my god! Oh my god! Dude, what the fuck, man? That was so good! No! I'm not seeing it. No, 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 no. You recorded that? Uh, look at your face. <laughs> I was scared, oh Jed. You can't just jump out at somebody. I'm in the middle of the woods. It's scary. I'm oh, sorry, don't scare you. If we send that to anybody, <gasps> I'm what? gonna kill you. I didn't know you had such a cute little lady like Scream, Michael. <laughs> Guess you never really know someone until you've scared the pants off of them. <laughs> As far as I can tell, my pants are still on. Oh, is that so? Yeah. Looks like you have to try harder. A challenge, eh? Well, I hope you
you're strapped in, because you're about to feel the full force of my mind-melting thrill skills. That looked like Jess right there. little lovebird carving. Intended. I came up here with them last year, but seriously, do you, I look like the kind of guy who carves hearts on trees? <laughs> I wouldn't have pegged you for a sissy screamer either, but can you ever really know a person? It had to be Emma. She can get all gross and mushy. Yeah, sure, sure. You going the right way? No, oh, this one. This is, oh my God. Wrong way again. Actually, I think. Hold on. Wait, that was that way. Let's go back this way. Make sure I know where to grab it though. Yep. Alright, let's get on with it. Hello? 
Someone there? But that's gonna do anything. Charming. It's everything you described, Michael. Wait, what? The cabin. I love it. Yeah. my culinary jobs. Fucking dares, man. What is that? What the fuck? I'm not sure I want to know. What the fuck is that? Oh shit. soon. Okay, buddy. It'll be over soon. Run! Run! Oh my god! What the hell was that? I don't know! Oh, there's a bridge! Over here! Over here! Mike! Get over here!
Come on, Jess. Oh! Come on, we gotta go! I am! <sighs> Mike, get the key! Get it open! <sighs> Barging in, I promise. How can you be sure? Because I'm pretty sure bears don't know how to open cabin doors. I've seen them open car doors. What? Where? On the internet. Really? Okay. Well, this isn't the internet, Jess. Right? This is real life. And I promise you that no bear or anything else is going to open that cabin door. I guess you're right. Okay. I'm almost feeling relaxed again. Almost. Huh. Typical. Arr. This is not the cozy chalet I was promised, Mike. Yeah, it's a bit drafty or something, right? Well, there is a fireplace. Well, we don't need a fire to heat things up. Michael, I am a lady, and a lady needs a proper romantic setting. <laughs> okay. A lady would like to cuddle up with her man by a nice cozy fire bathed in atmospheric mood lighting. Right. It'll get plenty toasty once we're rubbing up against each other. Mike. Yeah. Fire and mood lighting. Yes. My lady. Alright, I'm gonna cut it here, guys. This is getting pretty crazy.